No, I gotta say, this place is a pretty damn good place for um, grinding as well. Considering how... Oh, oh yeah, we just have to tap it. All right. Um, so this is apparently... Oh, the psychedelic music is still hurting me. Um, how much money do I have? Oh, yeah, we gotta deposit all that shit. Just in case. Uh, deposit. Um, this, will this go overboard or something? Let's see. Let's put 7,000 just in case. Does it say 99999 or... No, no, it goes overboard. Okay, that's good. But, of course, there's no, um, fifth digit. God damn it. There's no fifth digit, so we want $100,000. That's not gonna work. Jesus, fuck, $100,000? Really? Alright, um... Five? Nine? Yeah, that's good. Alright, let's sleep, because we did grind a little bit. Good night, Bench! Uh... I like this place. I like it so much. Walking, and I guess he also fixed the broken tube as well. Came a hungry HP sucker. Awesome. Is that a one-time use thing only, or is that just... Can I use it multiple times? I'll be awesome if I could use it multiple times uh, from the descriptions from what I'm seeing so far. Also, I bought a multiple rocket battle, by the way. I'm from Marvin. Sucks up some HP from all our enemies. The more HP the enemies have, the more you get. Can be used many times. Oh my god, this looks amazing. Alright. Marvin, you're no longer the shitless. From the items I'm seeing so far, and from the what you're creating, this looks really good. Is there anything else that you could make? Broken bazooka. Alright, maybe I could use something with that. Alright, same percent people go to the right, huh? Well, I'm apparently the 30% people that go to the right. Keep this board in mind. <laughs> okay. A lot of presents! Oh shit, and they're attacking us too. Alright, gotta be careful then. Or I could just auto-grind them. Gains 912, alright, that doesn't give us too much. Even though you can't get up there now, you might be able to later. Alright, I gotta keep a hint on all these boards. Your first goal is to reach for the four ropes. Alright, I should do that. Um, there's one there, there's also a sign there. There's also another bench there. You have a long way to go, get some rest before you- okay. I have a feeling this is gonna be like just a completely dazzling maze or some shit. And also, also a lot of presents. I'm not sure if these presents are going to be enemies or not. Open the presents. There's a Maw Kuhiyo soup inside. Place an item at the end, at the dead end. You're free to take whatever you want. Place an, place an item at the dead end. Okay. Alright then, so anything that reaches to a dead end, that's where you can get the item. Um, I'm not going to go up there just yet. I'm going to go this way, see what's up. A dungeon is, once a dungeon is built, monsters always start moving in. Alright. There's a lot of mushrooms up there. This is not a dead end, so this is... Oh, no, wait, it is a dead end, apparently. Got five dollars! Come on, really? Just five dollars? Alright, items are easy to get to... Are... Items that are easy to get to are usually disappointing. Okay, I gotta keep that in mind. Oh, shit. And items like those are gonna attack you, of course. And apparently this one's a mystical road, okay? I remembered you when you kidnapped Korra. And you're apparently weak as balls as well, alright. This dungeon's not too bad. Um, oh my god, there's where lots of multiple roads. So there's a snake inside, Marvin takes it. Uh, I have a sense that there's gonna be a lot of things I'm gonna sell later on. So we need to find four ropes. Oh hey, hello! There they are. Um, what is this? Don't be a slacker. If you work hard, you'll get good stuff. And this one? I can agree more with the opinion of the left billboard! <laughs> Oh, I fucking love the humor in this game. I love it so much. Super Flush Bear! Fuck yeah! Awesome! Yeah, and Marvin. I, I guess you need the protection, I guess. I don't know. Alright, so I know the placements, maybe. Yeah, okay. I just need to... I haven't went to this right road yet. No, never mind. I have. Hello, it's your dad. You've been out far there for quite a long time. It may be none of my business, but don't you think it would be a good idea to take a break? Oops, no. You should find a... St nah, nah. I, well, I meant no, but... I keep in mind the bad guys, but no, I'm not gonna take a break just yet, obviously. Um, how'd I get there? Oh, this way, maybe, I'm guessing. At least I know where to take the four ropes. What the fuck? Did those guys just multiply? And are the items that I just got? What the fuck? Oh my god, I'm so confused. This place is so confusing. I feel like I've gotten those presents already, but. Apparently, I didn't. That was this one. While you explore the dungeon, why don't you make a pit stop? What's this door? 
I wonder why I'm in this restroom right here. Just who am I? What is life all about? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I make you nervous? I'm not dangerous. Don't worry. Really? Okay. I'm still a, bit, a little bit concerning, though. Uh, left side. What's over here on? Another chair. There's a useful item at the dead end after you make a quite a long walk. Alright. A couple life noodles, but he has quite too much stuff, alright. So we really need to... Let's use a skip sandwich because, yeah. We'll go faster that way anyway, so... I guess we didn't really need the... lap, but whatever. We're faster now, so that's, that's all that matters. Um... That's good. Although I feel like it's gonna wear out sooner or later or something, am I right? I'm not using this to get rid of enemies, we're just using this in order to, um... Oh, there's another thing there. Oh fuck, there's a taxi there! I built a bulletin board without a message. <laughs> but there's a- that is your message, isn't it? Or whatever, um... There's a fucking- there's a bunch of shit up there. The question is, how the fuck do we get over there? Mm, this should be interesting. Whatever the hell this road is. What the fuck? I think I need the rope or something? How the fuck do I get over there? Also, fuck, my sandwich ran out of speed. That sucks. Alright, so I didn't get that item yet. But there's definitely something foreboding about this place. And how we could get to those areas. There's a phone there, so I'm guessing these signs in that fucking car and whatever. What the hell? Alright, what are these signs for? Let's start with the right first. The grass is always greener on the other rope. I wonder why that is. Brick road. The grass is always green on the other rope. I wonder why... <laughs> the grass is always green on the other rope. I wonder why that is. Alright, what are... Where do these rope lead us to? Okay. Different places. Okay. What are this? If you work hard, you don't have time to get burned. Alright. There's nothing here, so I'm guessing this place is just there to give me a... Yeah. So yeah, these ropes give us different places to go to. I gotta keep that in mind then. Alright. Of course, there are also enemies there. Oh my god, there's another dead end. Learn from your mistakes. Follow this and you're bound to be successful in Earthbound. Alright. I'll learn from those mistakes. Thank the aim. Alright. What about this one? Holy shit, this is gonna be a long maze, isn't it? There's nothing but a long fucking maze. I think this is progress, so I'm gonna go to the fourth one. See where that leads me to. It's probably just gonna be another sign, who knows. Maybe it could be an item. <laughs> this should be interesting. Yeah, it's just another sign from what I'm seeing. You have a strong looking body. Why wouldn't you like to be a dungeon worker? <laughs> Brick Road. I would love to, but this is just getting really tedious. I like the joke, so that at least entertains me along the way. Because I imagine if it's just nothing but a walking simulator, then it'll just get real boring easily. Not only that, but there's also places to explore, to get items and all that such, so that's nice. This is the second floor of my body! Brick Road. Thanks for the info. There's also a bench up there. What's a dungeon? That's my eternal question. What is a dungeon? <laughs> I don't know. Is this what you classify as a dungeon? Oh, hey, an enemy. Is that enemy gonna join you too? Alright. Bring it on, bitches! Lesser mook. There's a bench on top here, so I'm guessing I could just get up there and rest. If I wanted to. No, I could have spied on them, actually. Oh well. Try freezing. Don't freeze me. Alright, Korra. 18 damage. That doesn't seem that bad. Then work on Super Flesh Bear. Good. God damn, that takes so much PP. You won! Huzzah! 5,000, that doesn't seem that bad. Oh man, I really like this place, but at the same time, I really want to grind from that. Remember that auto-grinding guy? 20 fucking... Uh, I need to get back there somehow. Of course, I'm gonna have to, if I do, I'm gonna have to backtrack all the way back here. I don't think there's a way to teleport over here. Core leveled up, awesome! Alright. One step closer to defeating Gigas. What is this? There's an item at the dead end. But I have been known to be, but I have been known to be wrong occasionally. Sorry, Brick Road. God damn it. Uh, what was the sign? Did I read the sign yet? The music is one of my greatest accomplishments. <laughs> uh, 
It smells like flowers here. If you can't smell it, your nose must be stuffy. I'll go to that. Oh, wait. Oh, nope. Alright, so there's also... How do I get to that bench, though? Also, isn't there, like, another place where I could go to? Right, let's not waste a bunch of our shit. Let's just... Yeah, you hell have Korra use that. Let's see what the spy does. That's 200 damage. That's really good. That move is defeated. Offense is that. Defense is that. Vulnerable to BSI fire. Awesome. I can see why. They awfully use a lot of uh, ice attacks. So, yeah. Well, I don't think we need to use that at all right now. Perfect. I'm loving it. I guess one, there's another pathway here that I missed. Because I'm guessing this is progress. So let's go and explore the entire place to see what's up. There's only one guy here. We could easily kill him. Didn't work out. Yeah, keep doing that. Freeze the fucking plushie bear of all things. It's a good thing we have that during this entire uh, dungeon escapade as well. The sign we went through already. Alright. Oh, this way. Yeah, more signs. Oh, hey, there's a bench. So I'm guessing wherever the hell that whole thing is. Good night, bench. May you relax and recover your spirits. We could also build something as well while we're here. Or not. <laughs> Jeff, why didn't you build the broken bazooka just yet? Come on. I'm waiting. Right. I keep forgetting. What do your items do again? They can be used anytime you want, right? Where is it again? Yeah, this is just heals up HP. That's why I'm and can be used many times. That's awesome. A slime generator. I guess this is sticking to the enemy. Sprays the sticky stuff to stop them moving. Okay, awesome. So I'm guessing that means that that will make them completely. There's a hole down below. You don't have to worry about this for now. Okay. Well, how do I even get that hole in the first place? It seems like I have to jump down the cliff, but I doesn't look like I can't do that. So enemy or the ten dollars. Okay. Ten dollars! Great, guys! Thanks! Yeah, I'm gonna... yeah, might as well. Let's use this to our advantage, actually. HP suck it. That looks really awesome. Holy shit! That, that heals too! Marvin, you can be your own healer! I'm really loving that item. All right, Marvin, your your technology will definitely help us through. Right, did I get this? Yeah, what's this? I put out a bulletin board, but there's probably unnecessary. God damn it. Uh, is this where the presents are? Yeah, that's uh, where the presents is, but there's also a hole there, too. Wonder how we get there. Uh, might as well. I mean, why not? Right, I think we explored this area already, so we'll go to the other places where we originally went. Uh, really do need more script sandwiches in our inventory in order to run real fast, huh? Alright, let's go. Cause it's gonna be a one long walk, ain't it? This item better be worth it. Alright. There's a uh, present there. Let's go- Actually, no, there's another present there too, so let's go get that one as well. Dungeon exploration is tough, but it's also fun! You can say that again, I guess. So, Guts Pill. Is there any um, items we could ingest? Wait, no, we could use this for sale sign, right? And sell shit? It's for sale sign. The customer is heading its way. Okay. <laughs> In this fucking dungeon? Okay. Huff, 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 wheeze here as fast as you can. I'm plumbing to tuck it out. What have you got for sale? Um. Would you like to buy this laser gun? Oh, jumping Jehus, I don't think I could buy that. What else can you sell me? God damn it. No one wants to fucking sell this laser gun, huh? Alright, what about, uh. Here it goes for copy. Um. Oh, I guess I could use a speak. Um, what about this Kraken soup? Yeah. Alright, what do you have, though, Marvin? Here, have a snake. Alright, sure, yeah. It's certainly worth the wait, huh? Alright. So, this is for a sudden guts pill. I guess I could also sell that as well. While we're at it, let's use the speed capsule. Oh, I know! Speed capsules! Oh, shit. I thought that's gonna make us faster in the overworld, not... Oh, well, whatever. 
Might as well use it. I mean, it was kind of storing up space anyways. We could just easily bash these guys. We're fine. Core, you're still 198. Jesus. God damn it. Use more shit. Come on, Cora. Level up faster. Alright. How much? Okay, so one enemy, it's about 2,500. That's fine. Open the present. There's a pizza inside. Cora takes it. Awesome. Unlike that other pizza company that ate our pizza while we we're trying to fucking. Alright. Order it. Open the present. PSI caramel inside. Alright. Um. For sale sign again. Alright, customer's heading his way. Come on. Awesome. Oh, sorry, sign, so where the fuck did you see my sign exactly? I mean, it's not very, uh, uh, let's see, uh, this thing's probably gonna be dying anyway, so let's just sell this out, right? Alright. <laughs> yeah, have that teddy bear. I should really do that more often, actually. So I kn know when my, um, bear's gonna die and sell it immediately. Alright. What's the sign say again? There's a lot of monsters up there, but don't stress out. Alright. Gotta be careful, then. This is the third floor of my body. Brick Road. There's also a fourth- Oh god, there's a goat. Gruff goat. They are a really gruff kind of goat. You think I could be uh, up to the task? I hope I do. I can. Oh man, those frame rate! Little sl slimy little piles. He has a bad habit of burping. Alright. Okay, there are enemies there, but we can't even get to them, can we? What kind of game design is this? But hey. There's a wet towel inside. Do we even need a wet towel? No, I'm gonna sell that, actually. Oh, no, we can't sell that because we need to wait until- Oh, my God. Alright. Alright, dude. Is this a tool shop? What are you selling? Um... We're making a living out of this. That's good. Yeah, we're gonna save this wet towel for later. Good night, Bench. Oh, we already know what this is. Oh, no, we, I didn't read the sign. I, okay, whatever. Also, why the fuck have you not fixed that goddamn bazooka yet? God damn it, Jeff. Why don't you take a nice rest rest? Okay, that's it, alright. Fuck. Mm. For sale sign. I really need to get rid of the fucking, uh... Whatchamacallit? The laser gun, too. But apparently no one wants to sell it, so... God damn it, alright, um... Uh, what exactly is the Molo Kolhia soup for? Here, take the Pharaoh's Curse. These guys are willing to spend out a bunch of money for these things. I could make a business of my own. Hey, Dad, I think I'm learning from your footsteps. Selling my junk for profit? Awesome! Uh, yeah, there are a bunch of enemies here, but we can't fight them at all. What the fuck? Good job, you finally made it. There's a board upstairs that says that. There's a board upstairs that says that. Alright, um... Hold on, I didn't take that- I didn't- I don't think I read that sign yet. So let's go- no, never mind, I definitely read that sign yet. It's the one that says you're in the third floor of the body. So yeah, I did. Alright. Where we are here. Good job, you finally made it. Return hole. Jump with all your courage. There's two return holes. And that looks like we can't even get to there. Goodbye, exit. Someday you should enter with courage. Alright, I don't think we could even get in there. So, let's talk to the face first before we jump into the hole. Hello, sir. Welcome. Why, did you heal me? Long time now see, Mr. Marvin. We met in winter a long time ago. I'm Brick Road. Roo! Yeah! I remember you! Holy shit! Doctor and Donuts finally made me Dungeon Man! <laughs> if you want, I'll come with you guys for a while. The return hole is over there. Jump in that hole, then walk out. I don't want to do that, though. I want to, uh, jump into this hole instead. Alright, see what's up. Another hole. Alright, where are we here for? Oh, okay, present. Why not? There's an IQ capsule inside, alright. It's probably smart for uh, Marvin to eat that, huh? Here we go. IQ went up by one because I think the more IQ he has, the more smart he becomes. Oh, fuck, we're back here instead. Alright, we're gonna have to backtrack a long way in order to... Oh, man, because I want to get those presents instead. And those are gonna take a while. 
So I'm guessing we had to, in order to do that, we had to go to that other hole thing, huh? Oh well, we got presents and I don't mind the backtracking. Although I do really, really want those fucking skip sandwiches immediately. Otherwise, yeah. This could get really tedious, especially if you already know all the jokes that you, you went through. So this is gonna take a while. Do we need anything else to sell? Lucky coin, crack and soup. Laser gun? I really want to get rid of that stupid laser gun. What towel? Yeah, we could get rid of the wet towel, why not? Better use that while we're on our way to victory. After this battle, of course. Oh shit. This should finish him off. See, we could heal. Ouch, that did a lot of damage. Awesome. Alright, we should be fine. Now, still waiting for a customer. Anytime soon. No customer. No one's gonna- I think it interrupts- if I'm interrupted by a fucking battle then. Wait, someone's already heading this way. Wait for them to get there first. Okay. Well, hurry your fucking ass up then. What's taking so damn long? Am I just being too greedy or something? Oh, whatever. Um... Yeah, there's no way to- well, there's also that hole as well. Alright, so yeah, I, I think I know where the holes take us there. Still waiting for a customer! What the fuck? Alright. Yeah, because that side is blocking the way, but can we actually move it or something? Goodbye, exit. Someday you should enter with courage. Look, road. Uh, yeah, uh, sir, huh? Oh, well, finally, about time, time, alright. Um, here, have this wet towel. 12 bucks, you fucking cheapskate. And again, a wet towel compared to, like, what, a laser gun? How much were you willing to pay for a wet towel versus a laser gun? Oh, there's another- oh shit, there's another exit there too! Oh shit, I didn't even know- wait, no, that's where we enter now. Welcome! Long time no see, Mr. Marvin. The return hole is over there. Jump in that hole and then walk out. Okay. But how the fuck do we get to that hole? I really want to know how to get to that hole. Is there a way to hack it so that we could get through that hole? Or is there like a cryptic secret tunnel somewhere here? I mean, there could be. Yeah, there's like... Oh no, that could be the wall, never mind. Let's see here. Anywhere here? Anywhere here? No. God oh, damn it. Alright, whatever. Okay, I guess I'll have to escape and do whatever now. I really want those presents though. Yeah, it doesn't look like we have no much of a choice. We have to go through. What the fuck? Where are these presents come from? Ow! Oh, you don't kill us. Alright, good. One damage. That's fine. Yeah, these guys are not gonna kill us. Mm. Yeah, we do- they do kill us. We got a fucking... 10, we should be fine. Uh... Bronze that. Fire that. And just shoot, I guess. Nothing really much for you to do there, Marvin. Could do the HP uh, healing, but uh... I don't know, there's a bench in nearby, so I don't think it really matters that much. Alright. You win! You won! Never mind. And there's also more presents here. Holy shit, there's a bunch of presents here wanting to kill me. What the fuck? Whatever. I think this song is actually more happier than the other music. So these guys are definitely no problem, right? Wow, just one fire and then everything's done. Might as well just auto grind this one here with a little few PP missing, huh? Cookie? What? I don't fucking need a cookie. I need to get rid of those shits, actually. Oh my god, why are there so many presents? Of all things, why now? Alright, whatever. We're close to a bench at least, so that's good. 
All right, so that was Dungeon Man's Dungeon. Holy shit, was that quite the experience. So after we're done fighting these guys and resting up, we'll be right back with the next episode of Earthbound. So stay tuned for that, guys. See you next time.